what's up you guys welcome to another vlog it's been a long day i'm in my pjs if you remember what i packed in my hospital bag this was in my hospital bag and i never actually wore it because i spent the whole time that i was at the maternity clinic naked <laughs> literally the midwives would walk in and i'd just be in my disposable underwear and no bra but they've seen many naked bodies before so i didn't give a shit um i'm alone this week zion is actually sleeping it's like almost 10 o'clock in the night i'm going to pump before i sleep and then i will wake up when he wakes up and i'm going to take you through the sitters away for work and usually he does the 11 o'clock he usually like zion wakes up at like 11 o'clock at night to have his bottle and so he usually does that feed so i'm literally doing this solo i just had a shower and i want to show you guys my my stuff so i washed my hair tonight and i really i experienced a lot of postpartum hair loss and i don't know if it's growing back or what but i decided that i need to take better care of my natural hair you can see here it is it's still wet right now and i put some leave-in conditioner but i was literally using zion's shampoo for my hair i mean come on but i got this today cantu this is the conditioner and obviously i've got the shampoo as well and the conditioner is so freaking nice but there's another product that i've been using that i use on the daily so i'm trying to revive this hair you know and this is dr miracle's feel it formula leave-in conditioner you can see it and i literally i'm not a natural hair guru so i just watch what the other what some natural hair people have been saying and that's what they suggested so that's what i'm going to be trying out and right now i'm going to pump and then i'm going to sleep and then i'll take you through the whole of thursday and friday so i won't have any help on thursday or friday today i did have help um i plan on tomorrow we're going to go to the pool in the afternoon and i'm literally going to take it easy i'm going to nap when zion naps and be awake when he's awake because it gets a lot he's at a stage where he's super clingy he wants a lot of attention lots of love lots of connection and so that's what i need to give him um so when he goes to sleep in the morning and in the afternoon he's on two naps right now and that's what i'm going to be doing so right now i'm going to pump and then sleep so i will see you guys in the morning the bed here so i've been up for like 15 minutes um zion usually wakes up just after seven so i'll get up at seven or just before seven to pump and i've pumped already and sorted in the fridge and he's awake now i can see him on our little monitor i don't know if you guys can see that uh, yeah i just watch him he's literally like talking to himself but i'm not gonna go in there just yet because i'm warming his milk up and once i've warmed his milk up um then i go in and give him his milk and change him while I, he has his bottle because these days it's so difficult to get him you know into a new nappy because he just wants to roll over and do what he wants to do and carry on about his life so yeah i haven't made either of us breakfast yet so i'll usually give him his bottle and then wait like half an hour or so before i give him his breakfast he's gonna have oats with blueberries and i'm also going to have the same except his oats are gluten-free so um let me just show you his bottle there it is 
I just gotta pour water into it. These days, because it's so hot, I don't really warm it up a lot. He needs something cool to drink because it's hot. Um, I just make sure that it's, you know, the fats are not sticking onto the wall of the. Excuse me. Oh, I'm tired. The fats are sticking to the wall of the bottle. Um, and then I give him his bottle. Yeah. How are you this morning? Did you sleep well? Huh? Did you sleep well, my boy? Yes? <gasps> yes? <gasps> oh, you're so sweet. Hi. Good morning, Zion. He wants to stand. Mm -hmm. You want to stand up? Yes. Cute. He's all changed into a new nappy. Um, if you saw, he sleeps only in a nappy because it's so hot these days. And during the daytime, he also just stays in his nappy all day. So. His six to twelve months clothes <laughs> hardly get used, and he's still having his milk. But I'm gonna take him to my bedroom now so that we can just have a lazy morning and a slow start to our day. I am still in pajamas, still not done my hair. Mm -hmm. I'm literally not gonna get out of pajamas until after his first nap because I'm going to go nap as well. So I'm going to give him his breakfast now. For breakfast, we've got oats with blueberries. If you watch my video on how I prep Zion's meals, you'll see that I put everything of his in little ice trays and I give him a row of three at each meal. He's already had his bottle, you saw that. And then now I'm prepping his breakfast. He loves oats. I'm so shocked that he loves oats um because a lot of people don't like the texture of oats but he seems to not have a problem with that which is great because mama also loves oats you can hear him screaming he wants his food I've just put Zion down for his first nap. Uh, I need to pump before I nap. You guys, this year has been so hard. Um, I'm constantly stuck in a place where I'm thinking, should I be focusing on motherhood or should I be focusing on myself and growing my channel and putting up videos consistently and baking cakes. Um, and I don't usually stay in my pajamas the whole day, just so you know. This is solo parenting week, so <laughs> I'm literally taking it very easy because usually in the evenings, Sim will come home and I hand the baby over to him and rest. But this week, I don't have anybody to hand the baby over to, so I'm just taking it easy. Usually I get up, I get dressed, um, 
and do my makeup i will still do my makeup today um after my nap um and then carry on about my business but this week i need a lot of strength i'm just literally hanging on you know like mentally especially so i'm going to pump now i pump six times a day now um i was pumping eight times a day and when i was pumping eight times a day i was producing a liter of milk every day or just over a liter of milk and now i'm producing about 750 mils of milk so um it's not that bad in terms of milk production so i'm going to pump now then take a nap when i wake up i will do my hair do my makeup i want to go to the pool today like i said with zan but it will depend on how long he naps for what his naps look like um because i want to go to the pool after three o'clock so that the sun is just not so hot and he doesn't get sunburned so let me get pumping i will talk to you guys later what's up i'm awake zion is awake he had an hour nap uh, I'm no longer in pajamas. I'm about to do my hair, put on a little bit of makeup. Um, and oh. he woke up at 11 a.m. So he's gonna go back down for his nap at 2 o'clock. Uh, excuse me, I'm still half asleep. But here he is, he's on the floor eating my shoes. And I allow it because some things are just not worth fighting about and it keeps him busy while I get myself ready So This is how it is the mom shamers go ahead and shame. I don't care <laughs> Yes, baby So I'm gonna do my hair and take you through how I do that and like i said i really suffered with a lot of postpartum hair loss if you look at the video of my six week physique update you will see how full my hair was and how long it was as well so i lost all of that length and the fullness and i'm not going to cut my hair shorter than it already is but let's get ready for the day so i start off by putting water on my hair there's literally, this is not what's inside this bottle. It is water. And then, once again, Dr. Miracle's Feel It Formula Leave-In Conditioner. This I use every single day. And it works like a bomb. It's like 115 rand, but it lasts a really long time because I don't need a lot of product when I do my hair. Um, so, that's what we're gonna do. I put a ton of water in my hair when I do it. Um, later on when we go to the pool, I'm going to... Yes, you want to be in the vlog? Later on when we go to the pool, I'm going to put a cap on. And so is Zion. Come. So that obviously I don't get sunburned. And yeah, I don't use a comb anymore. I used to comb my hair with an afro comb, but I don't anymore. Um, I just use my fingers to work the water in and whatever oh. other product that I use. Here comes Zion. Did I mention that he's crawling now? So that's it. Um, I just do this to it until I'm happy with how it is. And then I'm going to do my, my brows. So even though I'm going to be indoors all day, I'm just going to do my brows. 
um, so that it encourages me to show up on my stories on Instagram. Because I don't post every day on my feed, it's important for me to keep showing up on my stories. And I don't feel comfortable showing up without my bra stuff. Although I do it all the time. But, yeah. Okay, done. Super average today. But that's also because Zion is here and he, right now he's tugging on my pants. And I'm trying to get him to not. Sorry! He just fell over. Um, I'm trying to not get him to get him to not kick this tripod over. And he made a poo, and all I smell is poo right now. So I need to go and change him. But I also need to give him a cat wash, so it's fine. Here we go. This so Zion had a bottle of formula. Um, I usually give him about one or two bottles of formula a day, and now I'm giving him the mini meal balls that I made on the video for his meal prep I'll put that in the icon above he loves this it's so fun to see him feed himself So Zion has woken up from his second nap. I really had to work hard to get him to sleep. Don't know why, because we never fight over naps. Um, he might protest a little bit at bedtime, but never nap time. But anyways, I'm in this bikini. You guys, I feel like my postpartum body is coming along very well. Pretty happy. Oh, look at the shoulders, girl. Anyways. I put Zion in a nappy. Say hi, babe. I've put him in a nappy and I'm just going to pull the inserts out and he'll stay like that in the pocket of this pocket nappy. Yay! Hey! The sun has disappeared a little bit. It's a little bit cloudy, but it's perfect because I didn't want the weather to be. Um, too hot i also don't want to really put sunscreen on him because i'm not sure i didn't test it on him before and he's got very sensitive skin so i'm not going to take the camera to the pool i'll maybe take my phone to the pool and have a quick dip and then come back and bath zion and myself and then that's it hey baby boy hey baby boy Hey. What do you want to say? Hmm? You excited for your pool day? <laughs> We're back. Showered. I showered and Zion joined me in the shower. I'm back in my pajamas. It is 17 minutes past five. And I'm back in my pajamas because there's nowhere else that I'm going to go. And Zion is going to bed in about an hour's time. So we're just going to hang out. Tomorrow's Friday. It is the last night that I will be alone. <laughs> and the whole day tomorrow I'm going to be alone. But I've actually asked a friend to come through and work from here. Because she's working from home. Just because I need the presence of another adult. You guys don't really understand how lonely it can be being a mom. Especially during COVID times. This has been a hell of a year having a new baby first time parenting and being alone not fun i'm literally filming in the bathroom because the lighting is so much better over here um i do have a ring light but i just don't know where the plug point head is if you know what i'm talking about but anyways i'm gonna stop this over here for today we'll continue vlogging tomorrow 
Zane is sleeping. He went to bed at half past six. And it was not difficult to get him to bed at all. I think all of that treading water got him tired. I mean, we were in the pool for like half an hour, but still, he was tired. Um, um, I've had dinner, I had a microwave meal, and now I'm having a glass of wine. And then I'm gonna wait up until 10 o'clock. It's like just after eight now. Um, I'm gonna pump at 10 and then go to bed. Last night, he didn't wake up till 3 a.m. this morning. So hopefully he does the same. done my hair yet but I'm out of my pajamas oh look at the booty <laughs> um, I'm gonna get Zion ready for the day he's over here busy moaning at me um, and then he's going to take his first nap I'm not going to nap today I need to wash bottles all those boring things um, and then do my makeup do my hair um, I didn't show you guys today's breakfast because it's literally the same thing he had yesterday he had oats with blueberries and he had a bottle of milk this morning so i'm gonna get him ready i don't know if i should put him in a t-shirt oh my word i'm so sorry he fell um <laughs> i don't know if i should put him in a t-shirt or if i should just leave him in a nappy like i did yesterday because it is a hot day so i think i'm just gonna leave him in a nappy okay i need to tend to my child he's crying Sorry, baby. Say hello, everybody. <laughs> Immediately stop crying. <laughs> okay, let's get him ready for the day. I decided to put clothes on him because a friend of mine is coming over. That's not even the reason, but it's weird. The weather's weird today. It's like hot and cold. Yes, babe. Here's your dummy. And I combed his hair. His hair is getting really long. And I don't know what's happening on the sides, guys. I don't know what's happening on the sides. He was born with a full head of hair. Then he had cradle cap. And the cradle cap took away all of what is on the sides. And he was left with this natural mohawk. Yeah. So I took a nap. Zion napped for two hours, you guys. It was beautiful. I took an hour and a half nap. And I also decided not to do my makeup. I really just don't feel like it. Um, it's like already one o'clock anyways. Um, and today we were supposed to meet some friends. But I'm not sure if that's going to happen anymore. If not, I'm going to go to the coffee shop to get my Friday night slice of cake. Um, and a freezer chino. It's literally like... The evening now i did not film the rest of the day because i was having too much fun um it sounds better as you can see he can stand in his cot now we have lowered it we lowered it when he came or he started sleeping in his own room because i anticipated that he will be able to stand um and so in his cot we have all of these dummies thank you baby uh one two three four five and one in his mouth so about five or six dummies that go in there so that he can replace his own dummies at night time yeah. and he's very good at that um and yeah he sleeps really well he'll wake up once in the evening or in the early hours of the morning and i do give him a bottle i did not sleep train him i tried it for like a day and i just couldn't handle the crying so yeah say good night Whew. okay zion is sleeping uh i'm going to eat shower have a drink 
and sleep. This week was really hard, but it also proves to me that I can do hard things. Um, being a single parent, you guys, <sighs> it's not for the faint-hearted. And I was raised by a single parent, so shout out to you, mom, for being amazing. <laughs> Okay, I'm going to stop this vlog over here and thank you for tuning in. Thanks for subscribing. Let's get me to 20,000 subscribers before the year ends, please. So please share this with somebody that you think would enjoy this type of content. I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye.